Ghost touch issues happen when your phone starts responding to touches you didn't make. It's as if the screen is being tapped or swiped by itself, which can lead to apps opening, text being sent, or random actions occurring on the phone. This can be extremely frustrating, especially if you're trying to use your device normally. One of the main reasons for ghost touch is screen damage or malfunction. If your screen has cracks or internal damage, it might start to misinterpret inputs. Another potential cause is software glitches. Sometimes bugs in the operating system or specific apps can trigger this issue, causing the screen to behave erratically. Charging problems are another common cause. If you're using a low quality or incompatible charger, it may interfere with the phone's touch sensitivity, especially while the device is plugged in. Additionally, screen protectors or dirt can sometimes cause ghost touches as they can interfere with the screen's sensitivity, leading to false readings. When adjusting a lighter for a bigger flame, you're mainly working with the flame adjuster which controls how much fuel is released when you ignite it. Most lighters have a small dial slider or wheel, usually located near the base or side. Turning this adjuster increases or decreases the flame height by regulating the flow of gas, typically butane, that fuels the lighter. If you want to increase the flame, you need to turn the dial or slider towards the or in the direction that loosens the flow of gas. Doing this allows more butane to escape when you ignite it, leading to a bigger flame. Be cautious not to set it too high, as that can make the flame unpredictable or cause it to blow out more easily. The process is simple, find the adjuster usually hidden or requiring a slight lift to unlock and rotate or slide it. Small tweaks can make a big difference, so adjust gradually to avoid too large a flame. Additionally, keep in mind that environmental factors like wind or altitude can affect how the flame behaves and you might need to fine tune the dimmer lighter and accordingly for consistent performance. Once you've adjusted the flame, test the lighter in a safe area to see how the flame responds. If it's still not producing as much fire as you'd like, you can make further small adjustments. If the flame gets too high, dial it back slightly for better control. Remember that over adjusting can make the flame unstable, so finding the right balance is key. If you're still not seeing a bigger flame after adjusting, it could mean the lighter's fuel is running low or the nozzle might be partially blocked. In that case, refilling the lighter with butane or cleaning the nozzle can help. Also, keep in mind that lighters are designed with safety mechanisms to prevent excessive flame heights, so there may be a limit to how much you can adjust it. Once you have the flame at a good level, ensure you store the lighter properly and handle it with care to avoid accidents. And don't forget to subscribe for more fixes and tips just like this. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.